Hallo und willkommen, ich bin Meister Lenze und you're watching Get Germanized, why Germans don't buy air conditioning. Oh, Lambert, what should I do? Ah, ich weiß. Get Germanized. If you come from a country that has air conditioning all over the place and you go to Germany, then you might be surprised how little we actually use them here. But why is that? Well, many Germans just think that um, we don't need them because the few days that it gets really, really hot here, we can just... I guess open the window in the very morning when it's cold to let, let the cold air into the house and then do the same in the evening and let the cold air in the house because other than in other countries most of the time it is cool in the morning and evening so you can actually cool down the house and then just shut your windows, um, put the blinds in front of them and most of the time that's enough to keep the heat out. Germans also use fans a lot so you just put them there it does its job and that's enough for most of the time. So Germans don't really use air conditioning all that much because it just doesn't get hot enough here. And if it does, it's not really worth buying air conditioning just for a few days in the year because it's really pricey. If you buy a new house in Germany and you want air conditioning in it, you have to invest up to 10,000 euros if you want the top-notch thing. You can get cheaper air conditioning units at the hardware store for about 800 euros but they usually use up more energy and of course you have to install them yourself or pay someone to do it. And that's actually another reason why Germans don't like air conditioning because they are really like sucking the energy uh, and the money out of your pocket pretty much. And on top of that many people think they are bad for the environment. If you've made your own experiences I would like to hear about that in the comments below. If you're from Germany and you say no but we do use air conditioning a lot or if you're from Germany and you say yes that's why we don't use air conditioning or we should use them because you know just let me know in the comments what i've experienced is that we don't really use them all that much some trains have them but even if the train has air conditioning it often doesn't work when it gets really hot because i don't know maybe we just don't know how to build it properly or, or maintain it I have no idea what do you think, why do they malfunction quite often, at least from my own experience. Also if you're on a subway or something like that, um, it will in summer be quite unbearable, like the sweat will drip from the ceiling in some cases. At least where I studied, in the town where I studied, it was really really bad, especially in the mornings on hot summer days when it was just cramped and there were all these people that were all sweating and no air conditioning and uh, it was just horrible. Also many people like myself get sick very easily when you have air conditioning in summer like in houses when it's like a freezer in there then you step outside and you have this wall of heat Poof. just my, my whole body just doesn't agree with that and I get really really quickly sick I get sick very quickly and so I don't really like air conditioning all that much uh, at night I would sometimes like to cool down the room before I go to sleep but apart from that I don't really need it myself all that much. Like a fan is enough like I said before. So I hope this answered your question because I got this question from a subscriber. If you have any more questions feel free to ask them in the comments or wherever. Also let me know about your experience with air conditioning in Germany. Can you live without it or would you say oh no. I need air conditioning in summer or I will die. So um, whatever your opinion is, just let me know in the comments below. Apart from that, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to get Germanized. Goodbye and auf Wiedersehen. And now it's time to dance. What should I do?